Hello Toy Toy Review and Army. Today we did a toy review on special edition Lego Ningango Legacy and it comes with two minifigures. It's like a little comic book. Uh it comes with two awesome figures, which is Jerry versus Las Lassander, I think. This is the back of it. It shows you like a snake, so this is actually my first snake in my Lego collection. And here it shows which I'm going to go for it first since I'm not like a comic book reviewer. I'm just going to show you some pages. It's sort of comics and that, so on and so forth. And that is basically it for that. It shows you like all the pages. So that's pretty alright. And then moving on to the actual review. This is the packaging that they both come in. It's sort of like a blind bag, but not. Um, I'm sure you detailed. Um, starting off with the first figure, it's going to be the snake guy called Les Shang or whatever his name is or her name. Um, basically, the snake got one eye, but looks very detailed with just one eye. Um, so that is very cool. The snake looks very detailed. Um, he's in green or she's in green got a little bit of snake on the top you know like a cobra design on the back and you can see it's got on this figure it's got its tongue just like it's got on the picture uh, that's very cool it's very detailed on the legs I mean, it's got I've just noticed on there on here and on here you can see like a little um, skull that I think it could be like a poison. So this snake could be like a cobra or a type of snake that poisons you. It's got some type of um, thing like sword. This kind of looks like a tooth. I'm not too sure. Um, so this snake's very detailed. It's also got some detailing on the back. So that snake looks very cool. Very detailed and I'm quite happy to have a, have a very first ever Ninjago snake in my collection, so that's pretty cool. And now this is his opponent, the guy that's facing him, and this is Jay. He's actually, I think he's a ninja, yeah he's got nunchucks, as you can see. These are nunchucks, um, took me a couple of minutes to put these together because I didn't know how to do it. Um... But it didn't take too long when I realised what I was doing. So this is Jay's nunchucks. Um, Jay is actually one of um, the ninjas I like. But my favourite has to be Lloyd. And then the, and then the guy that's the red ninja because he has two swords. He's pretty cool. I think this guy is like a waterbender and his sister does similar things. And there's also another white ninja. That I think I did a review on before, I can't really remember. Um, so Jay's pretty detailed, just like the other snake guy. He's um, got a cool ninja mask on. That uh, Quite a lot of the ninjas have the same mask, but on different colours. Uh, he's also got cool printing here. He's got cool printing on the legs. On the back looks detailed. On this ninja, you also got the robe going around the back. So he's the black belt. He's also got little Japanese-Chinese printing here. If the camera focuses. So overall, both of these figures are very detailed and quite good to have in my collection. And I only picked this up for four pounds. Um, no, three pound ninety nine. Sorry. So technically, yeah, only basically four pound. So it's quite good to get this. Um, if you have a Tesco's near you, if you're in England, the UK, or anywhere in the UK, you can pick these up for four quid. So that's very good. If you're watching this video you can pick these up for four quid in your nearest Tesco shop near you where the aisle is where they sell these book things and it and it comes with this little packet that comes with these two cool figures and thank you for watching this video and i'll see you in a, i'll see you later toy reviewer and army peace out bye bye